Let's talk about how to easily round the edges of a photo or a shape here in Photoshop. Let's first talk about shapes. To round the edges of a shape, it's actually pretty simple with the help of the properties panel. For this example, I'm gonna select my rectangle tool and I'll just set this to shape. Now I'll click and drag out to create a basic shape on my photo here. And now we have the properties panel that automatically opens for us. If I scroll down to the appearance settings, you'll see this area where there's a bunch of rounded corners. And since this link icon is enabled, if I hover over one of these corners and adjust it like so, it's going to add the same value to all of my other corners. So if I continue to drag this up, notice how the edges of my shape now become rounded. Now to make this even easier, you'll notice that there's these little blue circles within the shape that you just created. If you click on any of these circles and then drag outwards, it will make it less rounded, or if you drag inwards, it will make it more and more rounded instead. So this is another really easy way to round the edges of a shape using these little edge controls, if you will. Now to apply this onto an image, the process is a little bit different, but it's still just as easy. Deleting my shape layer, I'm going to once again grab my rectangle tool, but this time I'm going to set it to path. That way I'm gonna create a path rather than a shape. Now I'm gonna click and drag over my photo to the general crop that I would want with my rounded edges and I'll let go. Now once again you'll notice that we have our little corner controls that we can click and drag inwards to round the edges of our path or you can once again use the appearance settings here and just drag your cursor like so to make those adjustments. If you wanted to only adjust the roundness of one corner, you just wanna click this link icon so that none of your settings are linked now and you can just independently adjust your corners as you wish. So that way one corner could be more rounded than another if you wanted. Since I want them all to be equal, I'm gonna just undo so we're back to our normal position. And now we want to apply this rounded path onto our image. We can do that by going to the make selection option here within our path adjustment. We'll then set the feather radius to zero and click okay. Now with that path turned into a selection, we can click on our layer mask icon and that will now apply that selection onto our image so we have those nice rounded edges. Now, the next step here is very important because if you go and export this photo as a JPEG, all of this transparent area represented by the checkerboard will then become white. So you need to export it to a PNG to retain these rounded edges when you go and share it somewhere else, for example. Luckily, it's super easy to do this. Just go to file, save a copy, set the format here to PNG, click save, click OK, and now you'll be left with this image that you see on the screen here. It has a transparent background, but the rounded edges of the photo are still visible with nothing else behind it. Now, if you found this video helpful, make sure to hit that like button down below. And if you're trying to learn more about Photoshop, make sure to download my free Photoshop Blueprint eBook, which shares six essential techniques that I believe everybody should know in Photoshop. So if you want an easy way to get some quick wins in Photoshop, make sure to check out that free eBook via the link down below.